Dude, this I cannot first of all get over the fact that the attendance problems. I can't. Oh, it's unreal. I cannot get over it. They had 19,000 people in the stands. They could have gone 40,000 people. Did you hear what did you hear what the uh the ESPN broadcaster called it? No. He what? said I can't even call it a crowd. The group here is displeased yeah, with the what they're group. saying. Yeah, the group. I did hear that. The group. <laughs> oh man. The thing that's funny is I was watching that game and I and I thought that I had heard him say that while I was watching it, but I didn't it didn't like register. And then yeah. I saw it on social media later. I was like, oh my gosh, he did say group. He called it a group instead of a crowd. <laughs> that is so funny. So the Our game gathering even, of like minded gatherings. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they have a quorum. You yes. know? <laughs> Barely. <laughs> it was just enough for a jury. Okay. <laughs> The the game wasn't even competitive, both games really, but the first one was absolutely abysmal. Um, in game one, they committed four errors, did the Rays. Committed four errors. They could not get anything going offensively in either game. The postseason losing streak now extends to seven games, which is the current active longest losing streak in That's crazy. postseason across baseball. Seven games now. The Rangers scored 11 runs on 21 hits, and Jordan Montgomery and Nate Evaldi both just crushed it. And I did not think Montgomery had it in him because I bet against him, and I lost that parlay because of that one leg. I hit that <laughs> leg. I hit that leg. You did. Because uh, I had I had the Rays uh, five or more hits against him, and he gave up six. Oh, man. Yeah, See, I was cheering was... every single Rays hit. Like, For oh, me, there's one. There's it was two. like... It, I think the leg I I played was like four and a half strikeouts or a uh, plus or minus like above or below. Oh, and I, I said he's under, not. Yeah. yeah, I put I called the under and and he struck out I think five. Yeah, the one that was, the one that actually beat me that day was uh, Corbin Carroll not getting a stolen base. Right, I played that one on a. And he got he got caught stealing. Yeah, <laughs> it's like man, he did get caught stealing. It was a yeah. great. It was a great throw and everything. 